Yeah, he's a PA student at Rutgers, one of the top 10 programs in the country. It's pretty bad. <laughs> Me and Elijah both looked at her essay. We made our tweaks. Some we agreed with, some we disagreed with. Mm-hmm. And then, um, you know, she implemented our comments. And now she had the best version of her personal statement that she thinks that she had. And there is two interviews already. All right. Anyway, hey, y'all. My... No, I'm not doing hey, y'all. We're not doing that. I'm not in the South yet. Hey, hey y'all. Guys. It was... <laughs> Howdy, y'all. <laughs> yeah, howdy, y'all. But when I move to North Carolina, we'll start doing hey, y'alls. Hey, y'all. <laughs> hey, guys. My name is Boris. I'm a physician assistant. And I'm Elijah. I'm a first year PA student over at Rutgers. The reason he's laughing is every time Elijah does his introduction, he always says, I'm a first year student. And I'm like, dude, you got to say PA student. You, know, you got to get some cred. I'm still getting used to it. <laughs> yeah, he's a PA student at Rutgers, one of the top 10 programs in the country. It's pretty bad. <laughs> um, anyway, so one of my favorite things to get, I've been doing this for, I think, close to four years now, doing this whole, like, helping PA students and helping people get into PA school. Uh, just started on a whim, and since then, it's kind of grown, and it's been it's been really good to see. But one of my favorite things to see is not people reaching out for help, but it's people who say that something that either I've done or Elijah has done has helped them. And now they either have an interview or they at least feel very good about their program, their essay, or they're like, you know, they passed PA school and now they're a PA and they're, you know, they're helping us or they're um, they're thanking us for getting them there. So I'm just putting a few comments on the, on the screen here. I've gotten, you know, hundreds at this point, but just a few recent ones really, really stood out. Uh, this one right here just took it all the way. She bought my book. She used it to write her personal statement. And then she just really wanted a little bit of help crafting it, making just a little bit better. And, you know, we did a session. We talked about the the personal statement. I made just a few comments and boom, now she's happy with it. Uh, This is another person right here. Me and Elijah both looked at her essay. We made our tweaks. Some we agreed with, some we disagreed with. Mm -hmm. And then, um, you know, she implemented our comments and now she had the best version of her personal statement that she thinks that she had. And there it is, two interviews already. And so she's very happy about it. We're probably going to end up doing a mock interview with her. And, you know, once she gets in and it's no longer going to influence whether or not she gets in or not, we'll see if we can get her on the program, you know, maybe a live mock interview or whatever. Uh, And she already agreed to let us read her essay before and after our comments on the program. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, it's really, really gratifying helping you guys. I just want you to know that nobody's just doing it for money. You know, it's definitely a lot more money just working as a PA. We're doing this because we love helping you guys. You know, what do you think, Elijah? Yeah, I mean, we we were in the trenches before, so we 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 were there with you. Um, we got through that phase, but like, we're here to help you guys, right? Like, we're here to uh, be utilized as a resource to provide some transparency on not just the process, but like the specific nuances when it comes to personal statements or supplementals or interviewing. Right? We're here to help you guys. Um, and we're still pretty fresh. I mean, I, I just applied last year. Boris, just, he, he did it within the past like, five years or so, right? I graduated in 21. So I'm, you know, I've been practicing for two years now. Okay. Yeah. So it's pretty recent still. So yeah. we're, we're, we're still caught up on the knowledge and not much changes with regards to ad comms and how they view applicants, right? Or how they interview applicants. So just reach out to us if you guys have any questions or you know, want to like utilize any of our services? Like we we gladly offer that. Like I believe that we offer mock interviews, uh, personal statement, uh, editing, and I think supplemental as well. Yeah, so it's uh our services are broken down basically into personal statement editing, as you can see on the screen. This is my website, Boris the PA, and there's mm-hmm. contact information for me and also Elijah. Obviously, I charge a little more than Elijah at this time. Um, I've got a little more experience, but also Elijah's fantastic at it. Nobody, I can't say that I'm better at editing essays than Elijah. We just have different ways of seeing things, uh, but both have reached success in the same thing that you're trying to do. So either one of us is a wonderful choice. Um, Elijah also has just, I wouldn't say more time and more availability, but he's a little hungrier at doing this. Whereas I'm just like, do I really want to edit another one? Uh, I'm kind of working a lot this week. Let's make this like next week. So Elijah is more available, uh, but either one of us would be very happy to help you. Uh, what was I, what was I saying here? Oh Yeah supplementals, other things that are not like specific, we'll help you out with anything you need. We'll find a way to work it out. You know, Mm -hmm. if it's per character count or something, we just, we really want to help. You know, our services are broken down to make it easier. 
to uh to get our services we're not trying to like be rigid about it so if there's anything you need help with with regard to your pa school application just call us and also on that topic um it's not just pa school like i've helped a few different people there's been pathologist assistants there was a there's a bunch of programs i haven't even heard of like different mid-level programs there's like infusion perfusion or something perfusion yes school. oh that's an interesting one yeah mm -hmm. i didn't know that was a thing but it's a really small mid-level community kind of like pa but like way smaller mm -hmm. you know so essentially writing a good personal statement interviewing well it's all the same stuff man so we yep. can help with any of this stuff med school probably a little more specialized you probably want someone who's you know been through med school that kind of deal i probably wouldn't um mm -hmm. wouldn't say that i have any credibility helping people get into med school i like i'll be happy to read your essay but that's about it I know right. the application, uh, but these mid-level programs, they're all essentially the same. So happy to help anybody get into PA school, CRNA, you know, nursing school, uh, that kind of a deal. Yeah. We reach out for help. I mean, with me and Boris, we, we needed help when we did it. And, yeah. you know, I, I had to reach out to a lot of people for help. So just, just reach out, reach out to us. We're, we're happy to help. We'll help you when we can, whenever we can. So just, yeah. Yeah, email us. <laughs> well, and the thing is, we do this, I wouldn't say we do this for a living, but I've seen at this point thousands of essays. I know it works, what doesn't work. I've seen them, you know, very good. I've seen very, very bad ones. Uh, I've seen the ones that I know, like, all right, this is not much I have to do for this one. This one's already fantastic. Or like now that she's implemented my comments, now it's fantastic. And sure enough, a few weeks later, hey, I got an interview. It's like, I'm not surprised because this was really, really good. So like, mm -hmm. I know what works. I've seen the kind of person that gets in to like a bunch of programs and I've seen the kind of person that, you know, kind of struggles and doesn't. So we got a lot of experience, you know, we can definitely help or at least steer you in the right direction. You know, we can't Perfect. say you have a 1.6 GPA and no hours and we can guarantee get you in. No, we can't, man. But we can mm -hmm. give you some resources, help you maybe find an alternative route or right. try to have the best chance of possibly getting in. So there's no shame in asking for help, man. There really is not. I did. I did mock interviews. I had my essay edited by a bunch of different people. You know, it's just, you do need people who are experienced to try right. to help get in. And me and Elijah are two of those options for you. And we'd be happy to help. Forestthepa.com. Mm Forestthepa.com. -hmm. Forestthepa.com. Forestthepa.com. By the book. <laughs> I'm like, I'm packing. Uh, Same time. <laughs> by the book. I'm just going to have to put a picture of the book right here because uh, I'm packing my whole house. I'm actually moving out of this house shortly. Uh, oh, so I have the book in front of me, but I'll Photoshop it in. All right, where are you moving from? From Syracuse? Uh, so currently I'm going to move to my friend's house just to stay there temporarily because I got a long-term tenant renting this whole house. Oh, okay. Yeah. So the the retirement plan is a bunch of income properties, this being the first one. And now I, you know, I have to leave my home, but it's going to be an income property. So this was the dream. Ah, I see. Passive income. I like it. <laughs> Financial freedom. Woo! Well, I'm not there Financial yet. But... Yes. <laughs> one day. One day. It's a lot of work. But anyway, y'all, Zoom's going to kick us out. Um, buy the book. Or it's the PA.com if you need help getting in. More than happy to help you. Me and Elijah both. Okay. All right, y'all. Next question. Peace.